<laughs> Whoa, are you okay? I noticed you've been coughing a lot today. <clears throat> oh, it's nothing. I've just had this annoying cough for a few weeks now. It's probably just my chronic bronchitis or allergies. A few weeks? Have you seen a doctor? Nah, I don't really have time. It'll probably go away on its own anyway. I'm not so sure. <coughs> a persistent cough like that could be a sign of something more serious. Have you ever heard of COPD? COPD? Isn't that something smokers get? I've never smoked a single day in my life. Yeah, it's true that smoking is a major cause of COPD, but it's not the only cause. There's actually a genetic condition called alpha-1 antitrypsin deficiency, or AATD, that can lead to COPD, even in non-smokers. No, I think I'm too young to have COPD. COPD can affect people in their 40s or even younger, especially if it's due to alpha-1 antitrypsin deficiency. Plus, the symptoms can be quite similar to what you're experiencing. Well, that's kind of concerning. What are the symptoms? Well, besides a persistent cough, symptoms include shortness of breath, especially during physical activities, wheezing, chest tightness, recurrent lung infections, chronic bronchitis, or emphysema. I do get out of breath more easily these days, but I just assumed it was because I'm out of shape. It might be more than that, especially when combined with that cough. I really think you should see your doctor. The sooner the better. Alpha-1 antitrypsin deficiency can also cause liver disease and other issues, so early detection can make a huge difference in managing the condition. Ugh, you and your genetics. Okay, I will make an appointment with my doctor to ask for a test. Thanks for the information.